The power of assumptions cannot be overstated. By assumptions, I mean whatever you assume to be true about yourself and the world around you on a deep subconscious level. In this video, I will first discuss the concepts of the law of assumption. And then in the second half of this video, I will share how I applied this to my life to triple my income in less than a year. Be sure to watch to the end of this video so that you can fully grasp the knowledge of applying the law of assumption to your life so you can manifest anything that you desire. Also be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to this channel so you can begin living a life of true freedom. What you believe to be true about your life will be reflected back to you in your external reality. This is the fundamental principle of the law of assumption. It is not a theory, mystical or esoteric concept, but rather a fundamental truth of life that has been proven time and time again. Many people believe that they are victims of their circumstances, that life happens to them, and that they have little control over the direction their lives take. They believe they are subject to a destiny outside of themselves. I too had believed that. This could not be farther from the truth. The reality is that we are the creators of our own experiences. We are responsible for the assumptions we make and the beliefs we hold about ourselves and the world around us. The law of assumption is immutable and unbreakable. It is the underlying principle that governs all of existence. When we become aware of this law and start to consciously use it, we become the architects of our own destiny. One of the keys to the law of assumption is being aware of our own assumptions that we have about ourselves and the assumptions that we embody. We must be mindful of the thoughts we allow to occupy our minds and the beliefs we hold about ourselves in the world. When we make positive assumptions, we invite positive experiences into our lives. When we make negative assumptions, we invite negative experiences. It is important to note that assumptions are not always the same as our conscious desires. We may consciously desire one thing, but if our underlying subconscious assumptions are negative or limiting, and we allow them to run our lives, then we will not manifest what we truly desire. This is why it is crucial to examine our own assumptions and beliefs and to ensure that they are aligned with our conscious desires. When we align our subconscious assumptions and beliefs with our conscious desires, we create a powerful force that cannot be stopped. We become the masters of our own destiny and we invite a life of abundance, joy, and fulfillment. The law of assumption sets us free from external will being imposed on us. We become independent beings who are one with all of existence. When we are free from the mental prison of our own limiting beliefs, we can create a life that is truly fulfilling and abundant. The primary purpose of the law is to help you realize who you are and achieve alignment with the divine source. Your desires are a compass helping you to ultimately experience your divine nature. Unfortunately, from a very young age, we are bombarded with the idea that we are powerless little human beings until we awaken to this higher truth. I was taught that I would be subject to God's will and that there was a plan outside of me that was not aligned with what I wanted. I believed I wouldn't get what I wanted and that what I wanted and what God wanted were two completely different things. However, this entertains the idea that we are separate from God, that God is a separate being, which is not true at all. We are one with God. At a low point in my life, I discovered this truth of the law and I began to take control of my life. More specifically, I began taking control of my financial situation. I had been a prisoner in my job. I felt so trapped working so many hours and making an amount of money that was far less than I deserved. I felt like I was chained to my desk and I was so far from freedom. So I set out to attain it. I decided that I would work for myself and that no one else would be in charge of me or be in charge of how much money I would make or when and where I could work. 
This path to freedom was not easy as it led me to challenge my beliefs about money and about myself. I never gave up. The change started within myself and I decided that I would make over six figures per year being self-employed. At the time, I was working part-time at an upscale restaurant to help me make ends meet until I could make a full-time income on my own. I would tell myself over and over that I intended to make a certain amount of money only working a certain number of hours. I was relentless and believed with all my heart that this would happen. I finally got to a point where I realized I had made it on my own. So I quit my restaurant job as I was making a full-time income being self-employed and it only got better from there. In just about a year, I had tripled my income and I was working less than 15 hours per week. I had done it and I was free. You can achieve the same for yourself. Look within yourself and know that power is within you. Dare to assume that you have what you want. By no means am I a master at manifestation, but it has changed my life and it can change yours. The freedom that I feel is extraordinary, knowing that I have dominion over my life. It is a freedom that I would not trade for anything else. When we apply the law deliberately, it is true that the kingdom of heaven is within us. However, when we are unaware of how reality works, we can potentially and unintentionally subject ourselves to suffering. It is a beautiful thought that we all have an equal opportunity to attain our desires, be it to be insanely rich or enlightened. The law helps us achieve creative control over our lives, and we need to apply it with purpose and intent. You can manifest an abundance of love in your life, an abundance of money and anything else you desire by persisting in your ideals. According to Conversations with God by Neil Donald Walsh, we are living multiple lives simultaneously, including versions of ourselves who are, are already wealthy or in fulfilling relationships. As multi-dimensional being, your soul exists beyond the constraints of linear time. There are no limits to what you can experience in this existence, so don't feel guilty for wanting more. We are often limited by the perspectives of our elders, theologies, and religions. But you can break free by understanding and applying the law of assumption. With practice, you will get better at manifesting your desires and become a different version of yourself. You will become aligned with your highest truth. Change the focus of your soul to positivity and accept your desires as gifts from your higher self. Choose to see the good and experience all the lovely things you want in life. The first step that you can take on this journey is by saying, I choose to trust myself in this path of enlightenment. I hope you found this video to be helpful in your manifesting journey. Please be sure to hit the like button and leave a comment down below with your biggest takeaway. Also, please be sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon if you wanna be notified every time a new video is uploaded so that you can start accelerating your manifesting and have the life you truly desire.